and welcome to this week's edition of The Shine Guide. We've prepared a special feature on Sunshine Village's very own snow safety team. actually my snow study kit. So if I was digging a snow profile, so this is where I'm having a really good look at what's going on within the snowpack. A loop and this is a crystal screen, so that's going to help me when I'm trying to identify what different types of snow crystals we have. I have a ruler in here, a couple of thermometers as well, compass, um, a brush to help me identify some of the really weak layers. Mm -hmm. um, and, um, this is an inclinometer. Um, so that's going to help me identify what the angle of the slope is that I'm digging my snow pit in. And then everything gets recorded into one of these little books. So on a normal Sunshine Village snow safety at work day, I come in, we come in at about 7.30 in the morning and head up and do some weather observation. And then from there we are you know, if it's a control day where there's lots to do, then we might be throwing bombs or doing ski cutting and opening avalanche terrain as we're able to work through it. So another really important role that snow safety plays here at Sunshine Village is we're responsible for training the patrol and the rest of On Mountain staff in terms of avalanche rescue. Okay, so this is Peter Grumet and our avalanche dog Bear. Pete is our handler and Bear is like our last line of defense here. So he's one of the tools that we hope that we never have to use. Yeah. If our avalanche control work is done for the day, then we help out ski patrol and uh, respond to accidents. Well, the three best parts of my job, I think, number one, I have a great office space out here. I love working in the really dynamic environment that, uh, that snow safety and avalanche control presents us with. Number two, I work with fantastic people that definitely make um, doing my job and coming to work really enjoyable. And number three would have to be the skiing. I love spending the day on my skis and uh, shropping up some good snow. So there you have it, skiers and riders. That's it for this week's edition of The Shine Guide. If you're interested in being featured as one of our Riders of the Week, check us out on Facebook. I'll catch you right here next week for another edition of The Shine Guide.